Hello and welcome back to Wireman's Whimsy. Uh, we are continuing to work with the translucent florals bundle today. Uh, we're just using the stamp set and then one of the deckled rectangle dies to cut out the basic white on the front. We are also using the delightful floral 12 by 12 designer series paper. I love, love, love this paper. Um, and I wanted to create a card that could be uh, a bit more masculine, but um, can still be used um, as a feminine birthday card as well. I used the Lemon Lime Twist cardstock. Lemon Lime Twist isn't one of the colors in the designer series paper, but it's bright and it's fun um, and it can uh, blend right in. And when I was playing with what color to do the leaves on the front, I decided I was going to do the baby wipe technique so I could mimic what's in the background. I didn't use the pretty peacock because I wanted to continue that thought of bright and light. So let's go ahead and get started. I've got a basic North American card base. I've got a five and a quarter by four in the designer series paper. And then as I said, I used the deckled rectangle to cut out um, the card front. And it is the fifth one from the smallest or fourth one from the largest. So it's kind of um, in the middle there. Um, the baby wipe technique, I used um, granny apple green, soft sea foam, and very, or old olive. I was reading the French. <laughs> um, and then some daffodil delight to pull in that. Uh, this is actually lemon lolly, but um, it works. And what you do is you just drop it on uh, to a baby wipe. Make sure you've got a plastic or something waterproof underneath so you don't get the ink all over your surface because it will blend through. Um, and then you just take your stamp and you put it in your um, the ink pad that you've made and then you just stamp it down and you get that variegated effect. And I chose to do the greeting that way as well, but I put it in one of the slightly darker areas and then just stamp it down and we've got our happy birthday. So that is as simple as it can get as doing the um, baby wipe technique. So that is our card front. We're just gonna build it super, super simple. Um, lots of, uh, Lots of options as far as the paper you want to use, how you want to do this. You could do the baby wipe technique for the flowers as well, using those shades of um, the purples and the pinks. You could also do it with your teals um, and, uh, and blues as well if you wanted to. Um, I love that my videos give you a jumping off point and all of you that comment to say, oh, I used these colors or I did it in these colors or my favorite colors are the autumn colors. So I did it with the autumn colors. Absolutely 100%. I love, love, love that uh, you jump off from my videos and you, you create something that's uniquely yours. And that is the joy of stamping is to be able to create something that is yours. We're going back to these translucent gems again. This is a half sheet. Um, I, part of the um, product showcase at the, the fair that I went to was um, you got a sample of things. So this is just a half sheet um, of the translucent gems. I'm going to pop this one right there. So there we have same card, slightly different each time. This one I stamped more in the, the Daffodil Delight. This one is more in the Old Olive. Um, but that is our baby wipe technique using the translucent floral stamp set. So thank you so much for watching and let's create together again soon.